Well, uh, the pandemic uh, had been uh, uh, a dramatic situation for, for the treatment of many patients, on, uh, especially those with ID and especially those of surgical patients, oncologic patients that uh, normally rely on IV iron and you know that uh, the anemia clinics, most of them were closed because the patient had no access to the, to the hospital. And uh, uh, that's why I think uh, it uh, sucrosomal iron get a new relevance as an alternative to, to IV iron. And we are just uh, uh, caught this in, in, uh, in a document that we published uh, with many colleagues from many countries, uh, just uh, uh, making a, an advice to, the, to the, our colleagues that, and that is you cannot treat the patient with IV iron, just uh, try with uh, sucrosoma iron because uh, most probably you will get a good result. So um, uh, let's say uh, even in the tragedy you have an opportunity. So I think it's, 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 a, it's a bit of good... Uh, well, I, I, I would prefer that uh, sucrosoma iron pen, uh, pen, penetrates more in the clinical area in a normal way, but uh, you know, we have, I think that the, the, the pandemic uh, uh, of COVID uh, uh, bring uh, an opportunity to, to many clinicians to know the product and the studies in the product. And what I have, what I, what I, what I, have, I have heard about that is that the results are very uh, promising. Well, uh, I basically work with a patient, uh, with a surgical patient, and uh, my uh, job is to prepare them uh, for the surgery and to try to get them into surgery in the best condition possible, uh, to, and to try to avoid uh, the plasma infusion, but more uh, on top of that, we want to uh, improve the outcome. And, well, there is some data uh, uh, even for a, a very large randomized trial is going to be presented here uh, that demonstrated that uh, well with sucrosomal iron we can reach this target uh, without the dependency on, on IV iron and in a very comfortable way for, for the patient just the patient have to take the pill at home and that's it they, they don't have to go to the, into the hospital so and uh, I have personal experience with some uh, patient, even my wife, <laughs> having a sucrosomal iron with, uh, uh, with uh, and the treatment has been very successful. So my impression is that uh, he, uh, this this product will get uh, more and more penetrance in, into the, in the into the clinical practice, and this kind of event will help the clinician to understand that we are talking about something different. It's not, it's not a traditional iron. It's just a, a new molecule with a new property and uh, that is very, very well tolerated and there is uh, uh, very efficacy in most of patients. So I'm, I'm uh, optimistic on, on the future. Yeah, I, I'm, for me, it's fantastic to have 350 people here. It's, it's, it's unbelievable, no? That just to talk about one thing. It's not, uh, it's not a, 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 a standard congress that you don't have any topic to, to attend. It's just a, a single topic. And, uh, well, the people, this, uh, well, what, what I see in, in the in the audience, they are very interested and, and there is a, a lot of questions during, during the presentation. So I'm very happy with, with this, uh, to be part of this event.